Hello everyone. So today is the 24th of August 2024 and I gotta start off by showing you guys what we got today. So check this out. Um, Daisy in particular. So she got the Harley Quinn shirt. She's got the Harley Quinn toy here. She's got the Batman and let me open it up. Isn't that cool or what? So she's kind of like got her own little comic book here. So she made out pretty good, I think. <laughs> I think she's worn out because we went on a couple of car rides. But she's in theme here. So after she did that, I've got, um, I can just show you that and then that's it. I got uh, Suicide Squad on right now. And then Panther has the Batman on and Patches has a DC collar cover on. And then they also got this today, too. That's another toy. So, from Beetlejuice. So, today's episode for the uh, question of the day. Question of the day. Has been brought to you by Panther. Uh, Patches, who just left. And Daisy. So, they have brought to you the question of the day. And actually, some of what I got today, I got some stuff I didn't want to try also from Walmart, some new stuff. I was anxiously waiting for that stuff to come in. I'm still waiting on the uh, Coca-Cola Oreos to come in. I've been told they should be in within about a week or two. So I'll keep checking and seeing when they come out. But I keep looking for those. Um, I've got my girlfriend looking for them too, so hopefully we'll get those. But... Uh, did that, went by Walgreens today, got my photos, uh, went to the uh, um, the market, uh, craft show market uh, in, uh, open air market is what they call it, up there in Knob Noster. There really wasn't much to it though because of the rain. It's basically been a rain day here, so I've just been relaxing at the house more than anything. And yeah, so... All that has been done. So the question of the day for today is, what makes you feel weak? What makes me feel weak? Um, well, for starters, going off of what's what's been going on with my friend Jason, a.k.a. Marthy Maynard, which if you've seen some of his videos, um, I kind of feel bad for him. I'm sorry, I'm seeing a dot. But maybe it's just me. Uh, but anyway, uh, checking out some of his videos, if you haven't seen them, of, um, you know, him being in the hospital and all that. So, been praying for him. And uh, I'm glad that, and giving him uh, good thoughts, so to speak. I'm glad he's starting to feel better and all that. And he's going through the motions what he needs to. I know that's one time I feel weak as if I'm in the hospital or sick, even sick here at the house, even if it's just that kind of a sickness where I'm just like, dude, I'm sicker than a dog. You feel weak until you start feeling better. Broken bones makes me feel weak um, or bad injuries. I should say injury or Ill illnesses. Those make me feel weak. Obviously, they will. Um, what else? Uh, anytime I feel vulnerable. For whatever reason, I feel weak. Uh, anytime, like, uh, things are going on with, like, say, like with Jason when he was in the hospital. Or uh, here recently, a kid here in town got bit, mauled by a dog. Um, there was a fire in Sedalia a couple weeks ago. There was, you know, a couple at car accidents. I had a couple of... Uh, ex-classmates that I haven't talked to and God knows how long uh, came, came forward and asked me if I could spare some money to help them out and I had no money I you know I just got this vehicle and I want to help them but you know I I don't have hardly anything to give so um I wish I did. I wish I had more than what I, I do have. 
I mean, the reason why I went to PetSmart today, though, and, and did what I did there, showing you those purchases. So if you're going to look back and say, hey, but you could have, you know, that money that you spent there. Well, my friends actually, from what I gathered, my ex-classmates are doing better now financially and everything. So that was about a week ago before I got paid. Now I got paid. Now they don't really need the help. They got the help from other people they're doing fine now or doing better but they do if i do if i do need to help them i can now but a little bit not much but i can help them out a little bit but but at that at that time i couldn't help them out at all so i felt bad about that i think the one i can still help out a little bit but the other classmate our ex-classmate, I would say the things that are going on with her, yes, I could give her the money and help her out. But in the back of my mind, too, it's just like, I don't know. Just by looking at, in, uh, I might be wrong, but just looking at her lifestyle and everything, the way everything is going now, it's like, I could give you all the money. I really could, but I don't know what the money is going for. You know what I mean? So I don't know if I'm really helping you or if I'm helping out something else that I shouldn't be helping out and making things worse by giving you money. And she it's not like she lives close by, so I can't just give her food or whatever that she really needs. So I don't know what to do in that situation. I don't know what to do there to help her. I really don't. So that one, all I've been doing is just praying and hoping that things get better for her. The other one, the classmate, is basically for her sister because her sister is uh, going through some stuff right now. And that seems more, you know, and I probably will send them money now that I have gotten paid. I don't know if they still need it necessarily or not, but I probably will send them at least a little bit just to help them out a little bit. So I'll, I'll probably do that today at some point. But because like I said, I I don't know if I necessarily have a lot to give necessarily because I still need to put money in my savings, but I can help out a little. So I probably will help them out a little bit. I figure every little bit helps. And I also figure, too, if at least every friend or family member gives them at least, you know, say five, ten dollars, that will probably help them out big time. I mean, you don't have to necessarily give a lot. Just a little helps them along as long as other people are giving, too. And it seems like other people are giving, too, with them. So maybe it'll help them out. If not now, maybe you'll help them out down the road. You never know. So that one seems a little bit more probable. But still, I mean, you always want to do more. Uh, even when you pray for somebody and that, you still want to do more. And, you know, that makes me feel weak. Uh, not being able to do more than, I, than I've done. You know, you'd love to just tell, you know go there and just heal the person or save them from whatever is going on but in all reality you can't do that and 90% of the time that person's got to do it on their own so a good 80 to 90% of the time whatever they whatever the situation may be they they've got to get themselves out of it you know you might be able to help them out a little bit but all in all they've got to do it so but it still makes me feel weak. Like I said, it's maybe that's normal. I don't know. And and of course, death. Anytime death occurs, I always feel weak. Um, because like I said, it's just one of those things that I can't. Anything that you can't control, that you wish you could, but you can't control it. But then again, I think to myself too, like when it comes to death, when it comes to sickness, when it comes or people getting sick injuries when it comes to people needing help i mean do you really want to be the one that's in control of that because once you are then you're the one who's in control of who gets sick who dies who gets injured who needs help and who doesn't so do you really want that burden 
and I'm kind of glad I don't have it. I mean, yes, in a way, I, I wish I could go use that ability to help people that I know. But the thing of it is, there's this thing in life that I believe in called balance. So when you do go out and help them, does that mean that someone else is suffering because you helped that person out? You know, where, where's the balance? So... I mean, I don't mean helping like I'm helping now with my friends. That's totally different. What I'm saying is if you go out, you you know, you have that power to save somebody, say, that's supposed to die, then it shifts the balance of somebody else so someone else is going to die in their place. That's what I'm saying. I wouldn't want to have that power or whatever. So I just... All I can do is just help people what I can. Even if that means all I can do for you is pray, then I'll pray. You know, like for my one classmate, because like I said, I don't know. I'd love to send money. I really would. But I don't know for sure what that money necessarily is going for. I hope that it's going for the right things. I don't know for sure. You know, um, because I don't. The big thing is, is I'm just going off of what I have you know seen on social media but i'm not i'm not really next to the person to talk to them one-on-one -on -one. i don't see them on a regular basis you know so for me just to give them money i'm like i could but it looks like you're better off if i don't because i don't know what the money is going for if i knew what it was going for if that's truly what it's going for 100 percent, i'll help you but if i don't know I can't help you, you know. So that's that's my thing. But yeah, um, so vulnerable, sick, and uh, sick, illness or, or uh, sickness and injuries, um, whether it's to myself or others that I know. Um, of course, anytime I feel vulnerable um, and death, those all make me feel weak, I would say. So that's my answer. That's my answer. And that is all I have for you guys for this episode of, although it's kind of a grim thing to ask on a rainy day, but it is what it is, man. It is what it is. That's all I got for you guys for the question of the day. And I will see you guys on the next video. Uh, be sure to be a lookout because I do have a couple more uh, video uh, uh, videos where I'll be trying some different things. Um, got some snacks I want to try. And I've got a new soda I want to try. So, Oh, and there's a new energy drink too. So I'll be trying those things. We'll see how it goes. That is all I have for y'all for now, though, and I'll see y'all later on the next video. Peace out.